Hey everybody, it's Echo Papa, and welcome to part two of our audio settings, and it's going to be saving our audio setups. Now, now where we're going to do it is right down here. You see I have right here, it's listed config one, but we're going to go ahead and we're going to uh, set some different audio settings, and we're going to show you how to save them and how to delete them. Now, I use multiple setups and I'm sure that most of you guys do too so let's go ahead and I'm gonna set all of them up and I'm gonna set them up into different sound settings so uh, the first one right here is going to be uh, this is as simple as you can get uh, the master signal coming out of the, uh, the sound card that's in the laptop and uh, we see channel 1 and 2 and like I said in the first video channel 1 and 2 does not reference deck 1 and 2 it actually references uh, um, a stereo signal, a left and right signal. Now, uh, so I use this when I'm in the office and I'm auditioning tracks, setting playlists, things like that. So we're going to call this, we're going to give it a different name other than just some generic name. Uh, we're going to call this at the office. Nope, at the officer. There we go, at the office. Okay, so let's go ahead and click the, the little save button. And now when we come down here, we have two settings, at the office and our, our config one. So let's leave it at the office. Now my second sound setup is for a more uh, compact setup. Uh, I use an external USB sound card. Uh, so it's going to be an external. So let's go ahead and select the external mixer. It's going to split it up for us right here. Deck one and deck two. Switch it. Here it is, Maya 4.4. Maya 4.4. The same way where it says output 1 and 2, that's actually the stereo signal from deck 1. And output 3 and 4, that's the stereo signal from deck 2. So let's go ahead and give this a name. This is one I use with an external mixer when uh, I'm using a more compact setup when I am uh, just need to get in and out of some place fast or I just simply don't have very much space. Sometimes you get stuck in a little tiny corner. So we're going to call this compact setup save okay now let's go ahead and do one more uh, it's, it's going to be another external setup this one's going to be my v7 audio and this is going to be my main rig uh, because typically uh, at an event if assuming i have uh, the space i always try to use my v7s just because i have more control and i get really good sound quality out of them so we're going to save this one and we're going to call it uh, B7, whoops, B7 main rig save. So now, if I am uh, at the office and just setting up playlists, I can go to at the office. Yeah, if I have uh, a main gig I'm doing, I can select my B7 main rig, and now I can do my compact setup. And uh, like, let's say you want to get rid of one. Let's go ahead and get rid of this config one. You select the little delete button, click it, and it's gone. So uh, that's how you save your audio setups in the audio settings. If you guys have any questions, please put them down in the comments. Uh, if you like this video, please click the like button. If you really liked it, subscribe or uh, share this with your friends. Uh, so now you can go on to part three. We're going to talk about multiple sound cards.